Hi boys and girls, I am back with you to read you another story today. And if you look right here at the front cover of the book, you can see the title. And the title of this book is The Three Billy Goats. Now you're probably thinking, but Mrs. Lusher, you read us The Three Billy Goats Gruff yesterday. You're right, I did. Well, let me tell you something. The Three Billy Goats Gruff is a fairy tale. And it's been around a long time. And a lot of people have retold that story over and over and over and maybe changed it just a little bit. So yesterday we read this one, The Three Billy Goats Gruff, and this was told by Paul Galdon, okay? Today, we are going to read this book, The Three Billy Goats, and this one has been retold by Emily Banks, and the pictures in this book are illustrated by Patrick Guardo. All right, so let's read this one and see how it's the same or how it's different from the one that we read yesterday, all right? The Three Billy Goats. Once upon a time, there were three billy goats who lived on a high green hill. Little Billy, Middle Billy, and Big Billy nibbled the grass that grew there. One day, the goats came to a bridge. More green grass grew on the other side, and it looked so sweet. The three hungry goats wanted to eat it. But under the bridge lived a huge troll. He guarded it day and night and never let anyone cross. Eager to eat the sweet grass, little Billy started to cross the bridge. Trip trap, trip trap. Stop, shouted the troll. You can't cross my bridge. I am going to eat you up. Please don't, cried little Billy. Just wait for middle Billy. He is bigger than I am and much more delicious. What a good idea, said the troll. You can cross now and I will wait for him. So little Billy crossed the bridge. With his head held high, middle Billy bravely stepped onto the bridge. Trip, trap, trip, trap. Stop, shouted the troll. You can't cross my bridge. I am going to eat you up. Please don't, cried Middle Billy. You should wait for Big Billy. He is bigger than I am and much more delicious. Is he, said the troll. Well, then you can cross and I will wait for him. So middle Billy crossed to the bridge. Finally, big Billy started to cross. Trip, trap, trip, trap. And his very loudest, deepest voice, the troll shouted, stop, I am going to eat you up. Oh no, you won't, big Billy said and he rammed that huge troll right into the water. Splash, splash, splash. Away the troll floated down the river. Now, the three billy goats crossed the bridge every day, trip trap, trip trap, to eat the sweet grass that grows on the other side. So let's think about this for just a second. These books are the same story, but they're a little bit different, okay? Let's think about how they are the same. Can you think of one way that these are the same? I can. One way they're the same is they have the same characters, don't they? This one has got three billy goats and a troll. And what about this book? It has three billy goats and a troll. And let's think about something else. Who crossed the bridge first in this book? The little billy goat, right? Is that who crossed the bridge first in this book? Yeah. In both the books, it was the same thing. First, the little billy crossed and said, you need to wait for middle billy. And then middle billy crossed and said, you need to wait for big billy. And then big billy crossed and what did he do? He knocked that troll right into the water but that's where there was a little bit of a difference, okay? 
and this book, Big Billy rammed him. He rammed him right into the water. See? And the troll floated away. But in this book, Big Billy did something a little bit different, which is okay because the stories are a little different depending on who is retelling it. Let me find it. So he, on this page, he rammed him, right? He rammed him right into the water. But it said that he also trampled him with his hard hooves, which means he walked on him too. So that's different, isn't it? So sometimes in these stories, even if they're the same story, things can be the same or they can be different. So tomorrow I am gonna come back to you and I am going to read you another version of the three Billy Goats Gruff and we're gonna see how they are the same and how they are different. All right, thank you for joining me today. Bye.